You're watching EAC News. Thank you for joining us. Kenya's Maxine Wahom emerged victorious as the winner of the first ever all-women's rally competition held in the East African country. Dubbed the Lioness Rally, the race was held on Sunday the 27th of March and attracted eight teams all made of female race drivers, with veteran driver Safina Khan on navigation, 27-year-old Wahom finished the 12-kilometre race circuit in a Subaru in Panza, beating runner-up Tash Tundo by 13 seconds. Motorsports are still predominantly male-dominated, but rally driver and clerk of the Lioness Rally, Joe Nespit, hopes an inaugural race will go a long way in challenging stereotypes of women participation in the sport. If we have more rallies like this, we can get to having a WRC of only women, but it takes it takes a while. So hopefully we can have a big Kenyan one. Let's see where we can go from there. But it's, it's, at least now you can see people are more interested. There's a lot of spectators, more than we've had even in the Kenyan national. So with the ladies in the sport, I guess people are interested in ladies, so they want to see the action. Yeah. And I'd like to see more women coming and joining. As they've seen now, it's not that hard. Everybody thought it was a big deal, but it's actually not that hard. I think an event like this is so important because I'm sure there are some women who are shy in joining and they're not sure whether they will be able to find a car or be able to just, to you know, be part of it. And seeing that this is their first time as here for the year, and they were able to join and they did their best, which I think it just inspires women to come out of their shell. Given the strong turnout and spectators, organisers of the rally hope that this inaugural race will drum up interest and support for more women to join motorsports.